You forgot to dislike? How dare you? I still get more dislikes than likes, I think. <laughs> it's not funny. I forgot it was 420. I don't even know the meaning of 420. I don't even care. What is the meaning of 420? Does anyone know? Why is this a snooze? It's the same thing I do every day. I come on here and I talk and I eat. And I bees. Oh, it's a weed thing. I know it's a weed thing, but like, what? where did that come from? Like, why the number 420? Too much conspiracy BS. I know. Pizza's getting better. He's still congested though, but he's getting a lot better. This is very boring. What do you guys want to do? Um, I know it's boring. It's not really planned. I wasn't going to come live yet. <laughs> There's proof everywhere. What? What does that have to do with me? Did you story tell about... Oh, I didn't do the story about the Cuba... No, I didn't. Yes, I did, didn't I? That's an OnlyFans story. <clears throat> Why do I have, like, deja vu? My favorite was the New York rage. Oh, no. I don't like any of my rages. I will not lie if the guy... No good, I'm going to say... <laughs> No, no foursome. Nothing of that nature. Absolute rubbish. Absolute rubbish. There were no foursomes. There was nothing of that sort. <laughs> Pete, my beezers are weird. Yep. Do you think I treat my beezers nice? Eh, sometimes. You think I'm mean to them for real? Sometimes, yeah, sometimes. You get a little snippy. snippy. Well, that's not being mean. What did you order? Uh, not yours. Ah, from Connors. Yeah, pulled pork nachos. Pulled pork nachos. <laughs> well, this is always so big. Oh my god! You want to show people your nachos? Sure. What? Do they fuck up? Well, I asked for no jalapenos or olives. <laughs> Oh no. Covered in jalapenos and olives. Oh no. Okay, can you request a refund? Take a picture. Do you know how to do it? Request a refund and order something. Uh, they usually don't put it on there, right? Eh? No, they're usually better than that. They even press them off. <laughs> how do you, in good conscience, come on here with no subject? I mean, I've always done that. What do you mean no subject? Have I ever come on for organized? When? Name once. In the past year where I've done organized content. Am I forcing you to take your credit card out of your wallet and like buy a membership? I don't get it. Like why? What, what's going on? <laughs> no, it's like loaded with them. You can't pick that off. <laughs> it's like, so you, they said, you said no jalapenos and olives. It's like they put extra. Take a picture and be like, it's not what I ordered and they better give us a fucking refund. Eat the nachos for him? Well then what will he eat? Actually, I guess we could eat the nachos because we won't, we won't, they won't take it back. <laughs> right? I don't like pulled pork on it though, but... Many people... No, I'm not quitting the platforms. I'm not quitting... Why are, the... Why are you not letting me fucking... What did it say? I can't even fucking... Here we go, hold on. You have to go to no. get help. Yeah, and it's not giving me the option to... Let me see. Like, it's literally not giving me the fucking option to say that the order is wrong. Help with an order. Pass order. <laughs> oh, here we go. Shouldn't it be the order I just... Yeah, I'm not fucking get this fucking app sometimes. You took a picture? Not yet. Fully loaded nachos. Okay. Um... Are you gonna like reorder or? Item. All right. I would be like skeptic to order that again. I maybe this, get St. Hubert's. Maybe you know. I guess so. See the different item combo or add-on. I guess would be the thing. Eh? <laughs> yeah. Be like it, no. Say you they're loaded with jalapenos and olives. Like it's inedible for you. Pizza gets frustrated just like everyone else. Right, Pete? Probably more easily than most people, frankly. <laughs> what do I have in here? Chubby use. Hi, Chubby. Hi, Chubby. <laughs>
I was gonna include one of the box as well, because the box even says no jalapenos pull-ups. That's stupid, eh? Yeah. Refund's gone through automatically already, so. Yeah, it does, because we're frequent flyers. <laughs> and we only use it when it, there's seriously a complaint, so they probably trust us. Okay, well, give me the nachos then. Thanks. <coughs> Are you ordering drinks? Can you order me a soda? I guess I will go with boobs. Look at these nachos. Okay, let's see. Extra jalapeno and olives? Looks good for me. I find it hard and intimidating to get help for mental health around here. You? Okay, you said you wanted a, uh, another drink as well? Um, yeah. What did you want? Diet. I'm gonna pick the pork off of here. I don't want the pork. You can pick out the pork if you want. Because it, there's too much on it. I only eat pork sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> no, actually, that stuck around since, like, BB didn't eat pork either, so I didn't buy it often. Well, he was Muslim, right? Wasn't he? Yeah. So yeah, he wouldn't eat pork. Yeah, and I'm not a cannibal. I eat pork on my vacation, yeah, the chorizo every day, yeah. <laughs> chorizo is good, what can I say? I don't eat pork, you don't have to be, mu yeah, you don't have to be Muslim. Yeah, the pork isn't the same when it's not as part of the nachos. I don't really want those nachos either. I'm not hungry either. <coughs> you did just eat. I know, but usually I'm still hungry after I just eat. Oh well, here's what I'm going to do. I'm, oh my god, look at all the olives. Mm -hmm. Love it. Thanks for ignoring my super chat. I did answer you, didn't I? I'm doing a glow up. Yeah. yeah. Get out of here, you're acting like you have roid rage. <coughs> so Florida is now basically trying to, to basically just ban transgender youth entirely. Uh, they put out a uh, Florida. They put out a guideline um, Very good on to how to handle trans youth. Mm -hmm. um, so it's not legally binding, but it is going to be used to justify some horrific shit. Um, ostensibly, it's one of those protect the children bullshit. Protect them from what? Uh, like prevent uh, you know, a medical transition. Um, you know, no puberty blockers. Uh, no HRT. Nothing. Oh. Where it gets even worse, where it gets downright evil, is it also bans or tries or you know, argues for banning. Social transitioning. What? And that basically comes down to... Handmaid's Tale is real. I mean, I mean, like, social transitioning, that's basically, like, name and pronouns. It's, like, yeah. how you dress. It's hairstyle. It's, like, it's... This guideline is a de, a de facto ban on trans youth existing. If that's what they're doing, yeah. Like, it's not even, like, it's not even trying to hide the fact that it's just saying, no, kids can't be trans at all. And, like, even acknowledging that a kid uh, wants to, that a kid is trans is... Like, Florida's trying to make that child abuse. For real, this is going on right now. Yeah, if Mike wants to be Michelle, then, according to Florida government, anyone who calls her Michelle is pretty much in violation, or would be in violation of the law. Please. Please. I always thought Handmaid's Tale was a dystopian story, but you know what? <laughs> if things go that way, I don't know. It's pretty scary. That's horrible. Just because you don't live in America doesn't mean you don't know about American politics. Protect them from what? We should be protecting them from fucking bigotry and small-minded idiots. They live in Florida. They're already miserable. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's my opinion. I agree with Pete on that 100% if that's true. But trying to make it illegal for your children to transition? Like, that's messed up. Like, I don't know. Passion Tim didn't take their meds today as usual. Hello? <laughs> Protect the children from what? People like you, maybe? You guys keep calling it Austin Beezer, but haven't said one comment you made yet. 